Hey sweeties, it's Michelle. I just want to do an outfit of the day for you. Um, I guess we'll just start with the face. Anyway, I did another smoky eye. I just got off of work, so I just did a basic eye that I could go with almost anything. So I did a lighter version of the smoky eye. Um, typical earrings as always, and loving my hair. Hold on, I'm gonna try to put you down in here. Is that a weird angle? Maybe. Anyway, my hair is down and I didn't put any product or anything in it today. Um, I'm just letting it go natural. It actually doesn't look bad. I'm actually starting to love my hair. I'm, I'm loving my hair. I've been fighting with it for years, if you can imagine. Anyway, um, the necklace I am wearing is this dragonfly. Um, it's kind of like a filigree type, I'm trying to name, like a Fabergé egg thing. I actually had a guy tell me that if this was Fabergé, um, or vintage Fabergé that it would be worth quite a bit of money. Um, I actually got this at a fair, um, it's actually coming up soon, that, um, and at this little vending stand they have all kinds of very, very beautiful jewelry pieces. Now you know I make jewelry, so it's very rare when I'll buy a jewelry piece myself, but um, if it stands out, then of course. And this piece might have been $10, and as you can see it's enameled, if, let me bring it closer, is an enamel piece and there's rhinestones in it. Um, I've seen pieces extremely similar um, for hundreds and hundreds of dollars. So that's one of the reasons why I got it. They had it in a couple different colors, but I really um, like this one. Every time I wear it, I get tons of compliments on it. It's, it's just a beautiful piece. Next is this dress that I am wearing. Um, I hold this, I got this dress at Target. Um, I really, really, whoop, flipping you around, hello. Um, I really love this dress. I think I paid like $15 for it. It has built-in pockets, which make it that much more um, loving and beautiful. And it is a high-low dress, as you can see. And what I love about this particular one, if you can see, it's got this lace detailing throughout it, which I think is super, super cool. I really love this dress. I think it's just flattering. It's ruched in the back, so it's nice and tight up front and it's nice and flowy in the bottom. It's just really pretty and girly, and I just, I love high-low dresses, and this is like, I'm loving it. And then the final thing, again, is my Jesus sandals, because mom and I are going to a farmer's market today. So, I wanted to wear a pair of wedges, but not happening today. Farmer's market plus high heels or wedges, not exactly um, a smart move. No, I have done it before. I am one of those girls, um, we're originally from the city, so when it comes to uh, my fashion sense, it was always a pair of heels, always a pair of heels. I would go out in heels or sandal like open toe heels in the middle of winter um, and up where we live. We live in a very rural area, so um, to wear heels around here, there's no sidewalks basically anywhere. There's very, very few sidewalks um, around the area that I live in. Um, it's kind of odd, yes, very odd. At least when I moved here, I thought that was quite odd where I work now. There's actually sidewalks. It's like so exciting when you see sidewalks. <laughs> but, um, so yeah, to be wearing like stilettos and spikes and heels like that, not exactly a very good area to be doing so. And you get very, um, good at walking in them if you walk on them on a regular basis. But, uh, you know, I've twisted my ankle so many times in my wedges and stuff like that, just because the terrain around here is very rural. So, um, I learned my lesson. I don't want to hurt myself today. So that's why I'm doing flats today. I'm missing my heels though. That's why I wear heels at work. I'll have to do another work outfit of the day um, very, very soon. But anyway, guys, I want to thank you for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't liked the video up. If you like outfits of the day, I know I love seeing people's outfits of the day. I love seeing people's personal style. And sometimes you get a little inspiration from it as well. Anyway, guys, I thank you for watching and comment down below. Let me know what other videos you would like to see because I do a lot of hauls and outfits of the day and I do a little bit of everything as you already know. And I will be doing some more toy videos again very, very soon. Um, I got, as I've told you before, I have a Rudolph collection that's normally um, a Christmas thing that I bring out, but I have a bunch of toys from that and uh, collectible Barbies. I got. I got everything. I'm into a little bit of everything. I'm all over the place, as you know. Anyway, guys, I will see you soon. Take care, sweeties. Bye.